In this video, we look at first order theories. Let L be a first order signature. We define a context to be a finite list, x1 to xn, of distinct variables. The type of this context is the list of sorts assigned to each variable appearing in it. Then a formula in context, denoted in this way, is a formula phi and a context x such that the free variables of phi are contained in the set x1 to xn. A term in context, denoted like this, is a term t and a context x, such that the variables in t are contained in the set x1 to xn. The process of substitution may occur if a finite list s of terms has the same length and type as a context x. We write phi bracket s over x, respectively t bracket s over x, for the formula, respectively term, obtained by simultaneously substituting si for each free xi in phi, respectively t. Next, we define the content of an axiom system called sequence. A sequent over L is an expression phi turnstile psi with a lower script x, where phi and psi are formulae over L and x is a suitable context for phi and psi, meaning the free variables of phi and psi are contained in the set x1 to xn. We call a sequent atomic, horn, etc. when the formulae phi and psi are atomic, horn, etc. You may think of the turnstile as meaning implication, as in phi implies psi. Then a presentation of a theory over L is a collection of sequence over L. A presentation of a theory is called atomic, horn, etc. when each sequence in T is atomic, horn, etc. Note that there may be distinct presentations of a theory which give rise to the same models, which is why we say it's a presentation of a theory and not just a theory. So for example, the signature of groups has an axiom system consisting of the identity law, the inverse law, and the associativity law given here. Note that all of these axioms can be written as truth implies phi, where phi is atomic. This is an example of a single sorted algebraic theory, i.e. one which has a single sort, no relations, and the axioms of the type above. We will examine algebraic theories more in a subsequent video.